Many companies leading on climate action are investing in one of the world's oldest carbon capturing technologies, nature. But the lack of transparency in today's carbon markets is making many hesitant. Pachama is using innovative satellite-based technology to find the world's best forest carbon projects and now start an entirely new generation of high-quality, low-risk forest projects from the ground up. To mitigate the worst effects of climate change, governments and companies alike have set ambitious net zero goals. Protecting and restoring natural ecosystems can account for 3% of what is needed to meet global goals. But until recently, they have been underfunded due to an absence of reliable data. Pachama's technology changes that. Pachama is a technology company with the mission of helping protect and restore nature to solve climate change. And what we do is we use technologies such as satellite images, LiDAR data, artificial intelligence to automate the process of evaluating and certifying carbon credits from reforestation and forest conservation projects. And in doing so, uh, bringing more efficiency, transparency, and integrity to the world of nature-based carbon markets. Investing in originating new projects from the ground up, we believe is an incredibly powerful way to have an impact. For companies, it's not only a way to secure a price on carbon, but also a way to have a very additional impact on projects that wouldn't have existed without that catalytic investment. And that's how we're gonna generate the next generation of forest carbon projects that is needed for the next two decades. We visit the first Pachama Originals projects in Mexico, where Pachama has partnered with Toroto, who is working with dozens of local ejidos, rural landowners, to implement best-in-class restoration projects. Toroto is a startup company from Mexico that designs and operates large-scale nature-based solutions that increase the ecosystem services provided by huge project areas. The relationship that Toroto has with Pachama is very special. For us, being able to work with a partner that is so focused on developing remote sensing technologies and building so much trust with the demand side of the carbon market is vital. Y ahorita como lo que estamos viendo con el grupo Toroto es que nos está dando muchas posibilidades para que nuestro ejido, nuestro uso común se vea como antes. entre los los compañeros que están trabajando las cuadrillas es de que han avanzado muchísimo en el uso común de plantío de tantos arbolitos. A las futuras generaciones les va a traer mucho beneficio porque pues van a tener por lo menos un ambiente, estamos contribuyendo a que esté el ambiente un poco mejor, que ojalá y haya más lluvia, haya más mejor oxígeno. One of the most powerful things of working at the field level is that we can actually get to spend a lot of time and energy gaining a very deep understanding of the territory where we're working. We actually go and see what is below the soil and what is also going to happen above the soil in the next 10, 20, 30 years to model our interventions before they happen. So that we make sure to invest every dollar in the most impactful kind of activity possible. And we believe that this project in which ejidos and local community members are being employed, planting trees and caring for trees, is also an example of what's to come, a restoration economy around the world in which this funding can not only serve to protect nature, but also to create good jobs as we reverse climate change. Models like the Pachama and Toroto partnership are examples of the next generation of forest restoration projects built in transparency, community engagement and science. <laughs> 